Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another video. Thoughts about the Hurt Bay video. Yeah, I know I'm a couple days late getting in on this, but um, when I'm for real, for real, I, I really do have a life outside of YouTube. So, you know, I was like, man, I could hang out with the sons or I can make a video about this Hurt Bay shit. I hung out with the sons. I don't, I don't play them in video games, though. They kick my ass. But anyway, right? Yeah, let me let me give you my thoughts on it. First of all, from a personal perspective, I don't really care what went on in their relationship. I really don't. Because first of all, regardless of what they say in publicly, there's always more to the story. I mean, there's that old saying that... Uh, you know, there's three sides to the truth. Your side, my side, and the actual truth. So we don't really know what's going on. So I don't really judge. You know, I really don't judge. I'm tripping out mo more over how everybody else was responding to the video. And I, I don't mean the parodies. <laughs> no, not at all. First of all, women... Women were tripping. They were mad. It was like, how dare he cheat? You know, he cheated on Why would he cheat on her? I would slap him if I was right there. I was, I was like, yeah, y'all ain't going to do shit. Because most of the women talking about they will go slap the man, don't know where their man is now. I would ask every woman who said, yeah, I was slapping if he was cheating. I'm like, where your man at? I don't know. It was, it's like, yeah, I, I would beat him up. I curse him out. Where your man at? I don't know. And they probably know that man cheating on them. So if you ain't doing it to the man actually cheating on you, you ain't going to do it to anybody else. So stop all that bullshit. All right. And fact of the matter is some men cheat, okay? That's a that's a foregone conclusion. Oh, and women, don't think you're off the hook. I'm saving that for my next video. But so the women were mad. Now what really tripped me out, you had all these men getting on there and saying, oh, she is so pretty and she's so beautiful. I wouldn't cheat on her. You Bamas. And yeah, I said Bama for those who got a con uh, concern over the word. I'm from D.C., okay? We talk about how the fuck we want to talk. Anyway, right? These dudes were out there talking about, yeah, I'd be loyal to her. She was so pretty. Shoot, let me use a word that's more universal. Simp. It's like, damn, yo. Okay, she's pretty. Okay. We established that she is uh, aesthetically pleasing. You don't know what you would do with her. You know, it's like... Look, let me just... This is just a little bit of a tangent. And this is something I've noticed back in uh, the day, right? Like, men... Like, uh, like Ebony Magazine used to always have that bachelorette thing or, you know, available women, whatever. And, you know, they do it for the men as well. But I would see the responses to some of them. And guys would see a picture of a woman and a paragraph and be ready to marry her. What the fuck is wrong with y'all? Y'all don't know anything about that woman other than she's good to look at. That woman could be crazy. You know, and I know I'm the loafer brother, and yeah, I'm coming out with a loafer video at some point again. If I'm going to sit down long enough to do it, get y'all some good pictures, but... And yeah, I like a fat ass and all of that, but I got to get to know that woman. I don't care, she got a fat ass. The only thing that means is that I'll be receptive if she chooses me. And notice how I said that. But then if I talk to her and she's, she, you know, we just don't have anything in common or there's no click there, I don't care how good she looks. But guys talking about, oh, I'd be loyal to her because she's pretty. Well, dude, if she gives you a venereal disease or she empties out your bank account or you have a baby with her and she puts you on child support and have your ass out in the street or she just one of these evil ass women out here who will fuck your life up just because she can Remember that you said you got with her because she pretty. And men need to get off of that. Men need, to, men need to get off of that. Now, that's my tangent, okay? Now, I wanted to get into something uh, really about this video, right? Now, 
Here's here's an issue I've had with uh, women in that whole cheating thing. And yeah, I'm I'm, I'm gonna get into women cheating in the, in, the, in the next video, but all these women getting mad. Oh. Yeah, all these women getting mad about this dude cheating on his woman and saying what they would do. I've noticed in all, all my years, right? All my years. I mean, and this goes beyond social media. This, this goes back to when I was little. Very rare. It happens, but it's very rare that women actually look at the other woman. Now think about something. This dude, he couldn't even give a number as to how many women he cheated with. So, you know, and it's easy to say, oh, he's so bad and stuff, but hold up, hold up, hold up. Usually for a man to get to a point he can't count, that that that's like phew, you you talking in high numbers and shit. That man was a hoe. I mean, seriously. You're talking in high numbers. So here's the thing. What was up with these women cheating with them? Some of them had to, a few of them, some of them, most of them had to know he had a girlfriend. See, that's that's one issue I have with women. I got to call, I got to call women out on it. Now, y'all know I'm not big on doing that. I'm more about empowering the men. But women, too many women, Want to complain about a man cheating, but they ain't looking at who he cheating with. That's why I think years ago, 20 or so years ago, that whole DL thing was big. Because then they could probably try to pretend he wasn't cheating with a woman. But the reality is, if a man cheating, he's cheating with a woman. So what's up with the woman? Now, a few of them can say, well, he lied. But in most cases, a woman knows if a man has a woman. In fact, they assume it. I mean, you have some women out there. And there's a certain uh, personality type that they have. They won't mess with a man unless he got a woman. Or even married better. You know? I remember back in the day when I was married, right? First got married back in the day, right? Years ago. I remember what this player told me. And I had that ring on the finger and, you know... You know, I'm a happy camper. And he looked at me, and this, this is true to the game play. He said, man, you're going to get more pussy now. And I don't, I don't mean from your wife. Women going to see that and come on to you. And a lot of women know it. Y'all know it, too. Even though women know it, too, even though they try to be quiet about it. Don't want to say it publicly because then, you know, that accountability thing comes up. That accountability and responsibility thing comes up. But women, y'all need to see, instead of getting mad at that man, y'all need to say, well, hold up. What's up with the women who cheated with that dude? Because y'all try to act like men got, like, some magical powers can convince a woman to do something she don't want to do. If that was the case, more y'all would be bringing men plates. Straight up. But no, nah, I ain't got to call that. Women... Y'all gotta get off of that. Cause y'all know it's, it's, it's a woman cheating with them and somebody need to say, well, hold up. Why don't we check the women? Now I know some old school women though. Some old school women, shoot, they knew it. They shoot, they know it. They go fuck that other woman up. Cause they knew they knew what the real issue was. Because a lot of times, like I said, there's a certain personality in some women, some women, that you know, if a guy come up to him, he could have everything going on. But if he say he's single, they turned off. And all that dude had to do is say he talking. To, if he, she meet a dude, and all he's had to do is say he talking. He don't even have to say he going out. They said, well, no, I'm just talking to this one. They get fired up. And they know it. I got to call it. So in this case, in this Hurt Bay video, like I said, I ain't really trip over um, them doing whatever. I mean, psh people have been cheating since Adam and Eve <laughs> seriously my thing is how come nobody's calling out the women who cheating with this dude 
Now you got some of these women talking about they gonna slap somebody or hit somebody. Well, y'all need to be cursing out the women that hurt that pretty little girl. And some of y'all dudes out there who tripping, you know, y'all like, yeah, she's so fine and stuff. Well, y'all need to check those women too. I mean, seriously, we, we got to look at this whole picture. Let me, let me tell you something. In all this relationship discussions, it takes two to tangle. And there's always more to the story. So, yeah, that's all I got to say about it. I got more to say in my next video. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get deeper. <laughs> yeah, I guarantee it. <laughs> anyway, y'all, it's been real. Talk to y'all later. Peace.